There's literally nothing to do this weekend. No plans, no one wants to step outside. Might have to just do my coursework, I can't lie. What's good, Shoko? Did you hear Yuki is hosting a house party tonight? And you're just telling me this now? Don't blame me. Mei Mei was the one that told me there's gonna be a motive at Yuki's tonight. Apparently, it was last minute, but who the frick cares? There's actually something to do this weekend. Ain't Yuki's place literally on the opposite side of the damn country? Um, yeah? So how the heck do you expect us to get there in the next couple hours? I don't know. Maybe ask Ghetto for a ride or some shit. He's free this weekend, so I'm sure he won't mind driving us there. Ghetto is the last person we should be having behind the wheel. Did you see the fit he threw because some guy overtook him? Are you guys sure there's a McDonald's this way? Have you lost your damn mind? This is why monkeys like you deserve to take the bus instead of clogging up the road. Filthy monkey that can't even drive a Hellcat. <laughs> Guys, I swear it's not because he's black. I literally have black friends. I don't think I've heard that many racial slurs come out of one person's mouth, let alone letting him drive for three hours. Who knows what BS will just make him crash out and get us all killed. Nah, I'm sure that was an off day. I don't blame him. I would have done the same for real. Those monkeys did deserve it, though. Shoko, you gotta stop hanging out with Gato. Since when did you start calling bad drivers monkeys? I mean, there's no way an actual human being could be that incompetent just saying... Whatever, man, let's go get Ghetto. I swear, if I catch Yuji at Yuki's motive, I will genuinely tweak out. Him or the rest of his delusional bros will get put on a t-shirt if they pull up for real for real? Why are you guys even beefing? I think he's kinda cute too, you just hating. Shoko, don't piss me off right now. That's astonishing! It's absolutely world-class! Who could that be? Am I wrong for being real? Hop off my meat, man. Oh, it's you two idiots. Why are you so pressed, bro? Wait, we can't even give you a surprise visit anymore! Don't give me that crap! I already know you're trying to get me to drive you guys to that party! You know I don't get along with Yuki anymore. Shit got awkward with us. And I am not gonna go to a place where the host is gonna embarrass me in front of all the guests she invited. Wait, how do you already know? Mei Mei was begging me on the phone to come. Bro, I'm sure she doesn't even care about whatever happened between you guys. What even happened anyways? Yeah, you never told us! I don't want to talk about it. Oh, stop being a crybaby and please just take us there. You don't even have to stay, we'll find our way back. Please! I said it's not happening! Please, 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 please! One eternity later. You guys actually get on my nerves sometimes, I hope you know that. <laughs> don't act like you don't love us. Are we there yet? Yeah, we should be pulling up to the location in a few minutes. Yeah, then I went up to him and said, I'm you, and he deadass shat himself. Are you guys single by any chance? Yeah, you guys trying to have a double date? You baddies ain't gotta pay nothing. It's on the house. And they're gentlemen as well? Well, I think we found what we're looking for here. There's no way this bum got invited to the function. Gojo, do you know where you are right now? You're in my city now, so pipe the fuck down before me and gang really do something to you. Baby yes, bro, don't act tough now that you're around these hoes. I own you, you little bitch. Are you forgetting what I did to your sorry ass back in Shibuya? Gojo, chill out!